Hey guys, so today I wanted to do a review and tutorial on how to use the Remington Wrap to Waves. Basically it's a two barrel curling iron and you wrap your hair around it in a figure eight motion and you definitely have to use a heat protection glove but what I will say about this curling iron is that I am absolutely in love with it. It, the waves, my hair doesn't take curl curls very well, like they usually fall out, but I think because it's almost like a crimp, it stays in your hair a lot longer. These curls, or these waves, last for two days, and they look even better the second day, I think. I think they look more beachy and even more natural, but um, what I like is that it's kind of like a deep waver, but it looks more natural, doesn't look as crimped. Uh, and also with the deep waver you're like constantly going like this and you have to spend like five to eight seconds on each part of your hair but this one you wrap the entire length of your hair so it takes so much less time I'd say it takes me about 15 minutes 20 minutes to do my whole head basically I'm in love with this and I want to show you how to do it now oh yeah and it retails for around $25. I think I got mine on sale at Target for $20 or something like that. So always look for those deals and stuff like that. I love Remington products in general. Um, I have a few of their curling irons. So overall I would give this product a 5 out of 5 stars. It's affordable. The waves last a very long time. It's quicker than a deep waver and looks more natural. And I think it gives you the perfect summer waves. So stick around for the tutorial that's coming up next. Thanks guys! You're going to want to start by putting your hair half up. The bottom section of hair, I'm going to take large sections just to save time like you can see here. Slide the hair in between the two prongs and begin wrapping in a figure eight motion over and between the two barrels. I generally leave it on my hair between 8 to 10 seconds and for the bigger sections you want to leave it on a little bit more and for the smaller sections they heat up faster so you can take it off more quickly. Then you're going to just slide the hair off the curling iron and spray the bottom section after you've completed it all. I like using Aussie Volume Maximum Hold Hairspray. Next, you're gonna let down your next layer of hair. I like to do a big layer at the bottom and then a medium size and then the smallest layer at, top, at the top. Here you can see I'm using a smaller piece and that's just because I want the waves to begin to get more defined as I get to the upper layers of my hair and that'll also give it some more volume. But again, I'm using that same technique as doing the figure eight. And I'm not so worried about getting the curling iron close to my roots yet, but as you'll see with the top layer, I'll get closer to my root. Now you can see that I am on my top section, and here I'll be taking the smallest pieces, and I'll be trying to get the curling iron as close to the roots as possible to allow for the most volume in your crown and upper layers. And then I'll just slide it all off at one time like that, hold it for a second, and then let it fall out naturally. And one tip for you guys is when the waves first come out, they look, they don't look that great. Like the waves themselves look a little bit strange, but once you give them about five, 10 minutes to really fully relax and get to the way they're going to be, they look awesome. So don't get discouraged if you buy this and you're doing it for the first time and you think, wow, these waves look kind of weird. They'll look good at the end of it, so just give it some time. Yeah, see, that kind of looks a little funky right now, but it'll look good in a second. <laughs> and here I'm doing my bangs, and I'm just gonna wrap them as much as I can, and wrap them loosely though, so it's not too tight of waves. And then just kind of work with them to see what looks best. I'm gonna spray my hair again, and kind of, the hairspray you can work with your hair to make it look the way you'd like. 
And this is the finished product. You've got these really awesome waves. And I just think they look so cute. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you'd like to see more review style um, videos on different products that I'd like, please let me know. Or if you have any requests for this summer, I'd love to hear them. Always feel free to post links to my videos on Facebook, Pinterest, Twitter, or your blog or website. Thanks guys! I would highly recommend it. <coughs> Whoa! Oh, struggling here. <clears throat>